The opening of a new Hope Gas West Virginia headquarters was officially revealed in Morgantown today. Reporter Catherine Brook has more on that story. Morgan O'Brien, CEO of Hope Gas, was joined by elected officials and other dignitaries that partnered with the organization to finally celebrate the renovation of the new headquarters. O'Brien says that working with the state government and labor unions will bring potential job growth and economic opportunities for the energy industry. It's good for the state just to create more opportunities and investment here. So we see ourselves truly as a partner with the state and trying to convince West Virginia is a great place to come and energy is something that if it's important to your business, you're going to have the best energy you can have anywhere here in West Virginia. The Hope Natural Gas Company in West Virginia was acquired from Dominion Energy in September 2022. Today, Hope Gas has become a product of small independent gas companies and large energy corporations merged to bring advanced laborers to the state. Hope Gas is wonderful for the people of West Virginia, more so our union members that live in these communities. It gives us an opportunity to go to work in the communities. Uh, we take pride in what we do. Uh, we have this uh, state-of-the-art training facility that we train these folks that come through. Uh, we make sure that they're safe. We give them high paying jobs with good benefits and good health care. Hope Gas signed a contract with WVU in November of 2022, which helped the construction of the new headquarters that only took five months to complete. Nagy Nagib, vice president of corporate services, says that the renovated headquarters is 35 square feet and two floors, as well as implementing over 100 new employees. We incorporate all of our IT. Uh, some of our supply chain, some of our facilities, uh, 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 finance, uh, gas control, dispatch, uh, very critical. So we're going to be in total around 150 employees will be based at this office. Reporting in Morgantown, I'm Catherine Brook with 12 News.